Zavala opet ću biti živim nešto. Two more steps, huh? Two more steps left. Woo! Wow! That was one of the best innings I've ever seen under pressure by Rajat. And I've seen many. That level of striking in this game. Thanks, brother. That's some betting that. Watch out for him. <laughs> Probably the best innings by an uncapped player that I have seen. Outstanding. Ah, Omar Raja. He's very cool. He's very calm. He's a very shy personality actually. That shows in his batting. Very quiet. And um, you would get the feeling that he, he. You get the feeling that he's lazy, but uh, he. It's just his personality. I think he's a. Lovely guy who's hard working but a very shy personality. I like that about him. Of course, you feel great uh, when uh, you contribute to your team uh, like this. So, always it feels great. Uh, and uh, ending up at the winning winning note, so I think it's very uh, good move. Yeah, initially we, we uh, threw wickets are down uh, earlier. so. My planning was just uh, to remain in, this, in the present situation and uh, just uh, do one partnership over there. Uh, right from my second match against Gujarat, from there I was like, yeah, I can do something big in this one. Uh, to be honest, I'm not uh, focusing on this all these things. I'm just focusing on my process, uh, which I was doing so far. Initially, I was struggling to hit a bit. But that's where uh, Rajat, I think, made up and played some great shots and uh, he made my job easy. I think that's the key of a good team. Sometimes when somebody new coming in, it's important that the set batter is able to hit some boundaries and he was able to do it well. I think KL was the key wicket because uh, he obviously has the potential to take the game away. His, his game plan is such that he wants to bat deep and he has achieved that. And at that stage of the game, he is very, very effective. He has a, it's very hard to stop him because he has a lot of shots and uh, he, has, uh, he can shift gears very fast. And that's, his, uh, that's one of his strengths and uh, he, took, he started, uh, you could see he started hitting the boundaries that was required. Luckily, I think um, half bowled uh, beautifully and set up that wicket really well, I thought. And uh, I loved uh, Shabazz's attitude today with the catching as well. Some great catches by him. Overall, a very good attempt. I think he was the best fielder today. Let's, let's not take that away from him. I think uh, he at least topped 15 to 20 runs. Phenomenal fielding, phenomenal. I think uh, you know, he was an absolute treat to watch. Uh, Hello, happy with money. Always happy. Always happy. Honestly, it wasn't difficult because uh, uh, the, the stitches had uh, healed quite well. Uh, so superficially it's uh, healed, so it was not stretching and coming off. Uh, and that made uh, made bowling a little easier. Um, and uh, and yeah, I, I want, I've uh, said this before and uh, I want to be in those difficult situations. I want to bowl those difficult overs and uh, try and win the, win the game for the team.